So I would like to think that the days of the Kardashians is probably over because individuals are now getting to see that the Kardashians with their... Next we're going to talk about 2D versus 4D relationships. The power in finding the latter in this new era of technology, social media, and new perspectives. Nowadays, there is definitely a lot of focus on trying to grow a very successful life and try to maintain a lifestyle that has both happiness and, you know, fun, enjoyable experiences mixed in with success. I find it super interesting to see where people focus when choosing who they will be with exclusively. And they say who you choose to be with will be one of the most important decisions you make in your life. This is because you spend so much time with that person and they're tremendously going to affect your lifestyle, your life, and the outcomes that you have. If they eat unhealthy foods or do not exercise, we may be more apt to do the same and we will skip healthy food or exercise as well. If they are greedy, your finances will be heavily impacted. If they are dishonest, you may get stuck in relationships based on fake love or purposeful lack of birth control. Definitely be sure to smash the like button. If they are dishonest, you may get exposed to diseases or conditions unknowingly. These things will change your life. Having a supportive, honest, healthy, and enjoyable relationship may change your life for the better and help you be your best self. Life in a power couple. You tend to reach successes that you dream of way sooner and with way more ease. When it comes to a 2D versus 4D relationship, I actually made this up and I'm hoping that it really clarifies some things for you to really help you navigate finding and qualifying the best relationships for you. You may ask, what is a 2D and 4D relationship? Well, <laughs> the concepts that I created for 2D and 4D relationships um, include that for me, a 2D relationship is when a person seeks a relationship with someone that's like visually attractive, they may have some life successes, but mostly it's more for, it's more for a visual look, a historic generational wealth or minimal actual ways in which they are a triple threat within the relationship. For me, a 2D relationship would be someone that seeks a relationship because the other person is visually attractive, maybe they have some successes in life, or they have like a visual look about them, or historical generational wealth. But instead of like having really concrete, amazing things about them, they mostly have minimal actual ways in which that person is an actual triple threat within the relationship. This person within the relationship can't really be considered part of a power couple because they don't really have that much to really offer the couple. The couple instead would be a little bit more one-sided. The person doesn't really have that many actual ways in which they're really considered a triple threat within the relationship. Oftentimes the person is mostly show without much substance to them. These individuals are usually sheep and yes, men or women, uh, they usually just go along with the flow of everyone else and they don't really speak as though they have a mind of their own. They don't really challenge the other person to be their best self and they don't really provide too much to the relationship overall. It's usually a little bit more one-sided of a relationship versus a equal um, give and take of both individuals. This individual may stay at home and lay hands on foot on the individual's wants and needs. Uh, they couldn't really achieve success or wealth without the other person or without their generational success of their parents that came before them. They're takers within a relationship. They are incapable of giving within the relationship other than in superfluous ways. And so in this situation, I'm not speaking to stay-at-home parents. Obviously, they're an exception because the individuals that stay at home and parent, they're actually doing this from a giving perspective and they are there for children. Um, I'm talking really about the person that stays at home and doesn't really have much of a career or they don't really do much other than support the other person and lay hand and foot on the other person and what their needs are. So the 2D individual is more of a taker. Uh, they are heavily focused on their looks or on how others perceive them. I say they are not a triple threat because while others may be able to find success and be valuable to society without their partner, these individuals are often unable and heavily reliant on their partner or their parents' generational successes 
to achieve any success for themselves individually. Their value may be wrapped up in the relationship or based on the successes that are passed down to them from their parents. Some people are beautiful, intelligent, and athletic. They are successful on their own regardless of who they are with. They have upper level education and are successful within their careers or businesses. They may be considered a triple threat of a person. This for me is a 4D individual. It's a person in which both individuals are a triple threat on their own and successful regardless of the significant other and regardless of their parents' successes. Most importantly, they have like an intrinsic value about them because of who they are as a person. Who you are as a person is what defines whether you are in fact a 4D individual. And so for me, this is the next level from a power couple. It may be that you are amazing, but overall to reach the next level, you must be an amazing person deep down. It is that intrinsic value of who you are as a person that really makes you priceless and a 4D individual. You overcome any challenge solitarily and your life is only enhanced by having the support of those around you. And you congruently support everyone in your presence, so it's really a positive situation for others to be in your life as well. Both individuals are not solitarily just attractive. Instead, they are attractive, athletic, intelligent, educated, successful in their career, and have a strong set of values. So overall, they are a very amazing person. They are valuable to society and make the world around them a better place. They support others around them and they have a sense of standards for those who are in their life. So you'll notice that they surround themselves with amazing people as well. Oftentimes people look at them confused on how they can be so exceptional at so many things. The secret is often resilience. They often strive for success in all they do and they're not just beautiful or attractive. Instead, their value is in who they are as a person. They are unique special, caring, giving, athletic, intelligent, attractive, valuable, independent, and successful on their own. They make the world around them a better place and society would be a lesser place without them. They have values and standards. They qualify who they are with to ensure that those they surround themselves with are very similar in character and quality. They find selfless individuals just like them, those of selfless values who are very supportive to them as well. These 4D individuals are not sheep and yes men or women. Instead, they have boundaries and standards in life. They are not comfortable just cooking and cleaning and waiting on the other person. Instead, they have their own dreams and their own legacy to achieve regardless of others. They are not comfortable just cooking and cleaning and waiting on the other person. Instead, they have their own dreams and legacy to achieve regardless of others. They may have children, but they make time for achieving meaningful impacts to society outside of their family, their children, and their significant other. They are a triple threat, but more importantly, they are valuable and special internally based on who they are. Being 4D means that you qualify others. You have standards for yourself and you have standards for others. And you also have values. You seek excellence in all you do and you're really not stagnant. When you are coupled with another person of this high caliber, you are more than a power couple. You are the next level 4D relationship because of who you are. You have values, you are giving, hardworking, reliable, loyal, optimistic. Your love is not just 2D, materialistic, or superficial. Definitely be sure to smash the like button. Your love is not 2D, beauty and attractiveness focused. Your love is not 2D fame and fake luxury focused. Instead, your love is unconditional and anyone within a 4D relationship is truly the luckiest person, but the reality is they make their own luck. They are who they are and they qualify those they are with to ensure that they're not just pursuing other 4D individuals for their exclusive relationships, but the people around them are also of high caliber and values and similarly giving and supportive.
So I would like to think that the days of the Kardashians is probably over because individuals are now getting to see that the Kardashians with their money luxury focus are not very relatable and they're more money hungry than amazing people. Oftentimes you can see that throughout their businesses and I really hope that in modern society we all take a deeper look into the intentions behind companies and the intentions behind businesses and who we support on social media and then also qualify those who are in our life <laughs> and really choosing to surround ourselves with amazing people so then we can also be amazing and accomplish all of our goals and have an amazing community that really picks us up in life instead of bring us down. Because life is not about chaos, it's about actually having a lot of happiness and success. And so we really wanna surround ourselves with happy, successful people so then we can have a lot of happy, successful things in our life. <laughs> Dating is for getting to know other individuals and really qualifying who you choose to be with. You can choose to become exclusive with only 4D individuals. Marriage must be based on more than just how the other person looks. It is based on more than their ability to be agreeable. Instead, you're really searching for someone who can really challenge you and really help you be your best self. Someone that can call you out on your BS and really help you be a better person for it. Definitely smash the like button. Both individuals are exceptional and even more so when they are together. They are not just a triple threat, attractive, athletic, intelligent, but they are also people with substance and true effect on society. They make the world around them a better place, and their life is not about looking good and looking successful. Instead, it's more about being naturally beautiful with a heart that is unmatched. And also a mission to really support others and not just be their best self, but also support creating an amazing society that surrounds them as well. It is the impact that truly matters. They are individuals with strong values who focus their lives on impact and helping individuals who are less fortunate than themselves. They focus on things that truly matter in life. They understand the value of a human being and they are deep down givers and lovers. <laughs> they, in my eyes, <laughs> are a love bug. I just kind of like find it easy to love and really difficult <laughs> to be around individuals who just hate. <laughs> It really stresses me out. So surround yourself with love bugs, uh, people who are givers and loving just overall in their energy and who they are. They do more for others than anyone does for themselves. They are always giving regardless of receiving in return. They are giving of their time and their support and they're always there for others. They make time for others and truly value and appreciate others. Individuals may be quick to hate, on 4D individuals, but you can't reasonably justify this hate other than pure jealousy because the individuals are just amazing individuals overall. They only pick others up and they excel with hard work and they make the world around them a better place because of who they are and all they do. So in this comparison, you can rightfully hate a power couple because they may or may not have superb values and selfless life achievements. 4D is next level above power couple status. It is the next level because who you are as a person is priceless. Both individuals solitarily, but also as a couple, have an immense impact on the world around them. They're priceless and influential and they really change and enhance the lives of others for the better. 4D couples you can't help but look up to and admire. They may have beauty, but they are more than this. They are human, sure. <laughs> we can all be 4D individuals, and we can all go the extra mile to achieve this status and be above the norm. We can all be very valuable, not just to our relationship, but to society overall. Everyone is special, and you can achieve this status with not just being hardworking and accomplishing great achievements through life, but also by just being an overall amazing person in how you carry yourself. It's all about integrity and intention. What are your intentions? Are you there to support, give, and help others and really enhance the world around you and really be a positive effect on others? Or are you more concerned about selfish desires, status, 
fame, money, or other endeavors. 40 individuals are valuable. They're special, they're kind, and you can be this too. It just takes a little tenacity to focus on all of these aspects as you're succeeding in life. Really qualify and spend time with amazing people and achieve meaningful life achievements. Make the world around you a better place influentially with moments and resources available to you. Now, we don't have all the same resources and we don't all live in the same external situation. So you can only do your best and with the resources and situation that you have. And so this is all about just doing your best. Um, you can over time level up your life and be your best self. And that's really all we're asking for here in this video. So when you're in a 40 relationship, Others really want to join you and gain similar outcomes because you're a leader and you're finding successes where other people would like to join in that as well. Others really want to join you and gain similar outcomes. You're a leader. As a couple, you break boundaries and lay the foundation for societal improvements. You improve the life of those around you, but also the society as a whole. You are not 2D. Instead, people look up to you because everything about you is amazing. Importantly, your heart is one of a kind and you are priceless and that's really what makes you 4D. You are not 2D. Instead, people really look up to you. Everything about you is amazing, and importantly, your heart is one of a kind, and who you are is priceless. Here I say strive to be 4D. Be priceless. Go forth being your best self, and really choose who you're exclusive with. Really qualify others and find others who are priceless and 4D as well. Surround yourself with amazing people, and together you will accomplish the impossible. Create an impact and make the world around you a better place. Choose to have an education. Choose to have a meaningful career. Choose to be athletic. Choose to do sports. <laughs> Choose to focus on your health and you know how you feel and you look and how you're really reflecting all this on individuals around you. Your career that you choose will have an effect on your personality and your impact on society. So you should definitely choose wisely. Definitely be sure to smash the like button. If a person has a history of cheating, then you really can't expect their values to change. This 2D individual is likely not 4D and is not an individual worthy of you or your time. You can't really expect them to value and appreciate you as they have proven to hurt those around them. They have proven to be selfish in the past and they have proven to not necessarily care for the individual in which they are with when they chose to be intimate or communicate intimately. I recommend qualifying others. I recommend choose someone better with actual values and standards that really cares to be selfless and not hurt those who they are with. Good luck and go conquer your dreams one step at a time and definitely, you know, go at life surrounding yourself with amazing people, qualifying individuals that you choose to be in a relationship with and instead of searching for 2D individuals to join you in a exclusive relationship, try to go forth finding 4D individuals that can really enhance your life and successes toward accomplishing the impossible that you may not otherwise achieve without them. Individuals that are not yes man and yes women, but instead individuals that really challenge you and they help you be your best self and really accomplish your successes and your dreams that you're really looking to achieve. So comment below, do you really like the concept of describing relationships as 2D relationships, power couples, or the next level, which is 4D individuals? Do you like the idea of 40 relationships that really go into not just being amazingly athletic, educated, and, you know, really focused on health and exuding a level of confidence, but also being an amazing person deep down and a positive impact on society overall? Do you think it's important to really 
go into the modern era of 2023 and on with a focus on values, intentions, and having a positive impact. Do you think it's important to really find businesses and companies that have a positive impact on society when you're choosing who to support and what? products to buy. Do you think it's important to find companies that are environmentally friendly, that are really enhancing the world and making the world a better place? Comment below and let me know what you think about this concept of 2D versus 4D and then also about supporting amazing businesses and amazing people in life and really surrounding yourself with amazing people. They say that the five people that you surround yourself with are going to really heavily impact your successes and your life. And so this is all about choosing to be exclusive with somebody who's 4D and who's amazing of character and values and overall giving and supportive and amazing person who's successful on their own and doesn't really rely on you for their successes. And then together as a team, you can achieve amazing things. It just accomplishes nothing. Do you like the concept of 40 relationships that honey buns? It stresses me out. <laughs> You're silly. Definitely be sure to smash the like button and help support my channel so I can create more videos for you. Definitely be sure to click on the above images to subscribe and watch more videos and really help support my channel so I can make more videos for you.